Hey, um, so today I'd like to know a little bit more about your goals and maybe I can help you achieve some of your goals. Yeah, so my goal right now is to find an internship. Oh, okay, that's cool. So you want to find an internship. Can you tell me a little bit more about that? Like what kind of internship you're looking for? Mm, I'm not sure right now what kind, but I want to find it in the bank, I think. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Do you know what industry you want to find an internship in? Mm, no, I'm quite open. You're open? I'm yeah. open about the industry. Um, business related though. Business related. Yeah. Okay. So tell me more about this internship search. What have you done so far in trying to find an internship? Um, actually, I first figured out after I went to the rotation informations that I wanted to find an internship. So, mm -hmm. so far, I haven't done much, but uh, other than like deciding that I want to find it. Okay, so you yeah. know you want to find one here in Dubai, and you're open to the industry, yeah. but you want to focus on business. Yeah. Okay. Um, by when do you want to try to start this internship? I think I want to start seriously after Christmas break. Okay, once you yeah. get back, you want yeah. to start looking for one. Yeah. Okay. Um, so you haven't done much besides knowing that you want one. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, what kind of resources do you have to help you find an internship? Mm -hmm. I don't know, I, the internet? Mm -hmm. And I guess Holt may have some contacts. Okay. Um, Holt. Yeah. Um, I don't have a big network here, but I like to attend more networking events. Mm -hmm. okay. Hence, I'm in the networking uh, club. Okay. What steps do you think you need to take to get an internship? Mm -hmm. I need to like finalize my CV. Oh yeah. So I have to see mm -hmm. if you can help, yeah. So finalize it and also um, create it towards searching for a internship. Mm -hmm. Tailor it? Yeah. Tailor it. Tailor it. yeah. Okay. What, once you finish your CV, what else might you need to do to get an internship? Mm -hmm. I don't know. You know? Okay. Right now. Uh, reach out to people. Okay. Like this. Um, also, there is like Danes in Dubai. I could attend some of these events. Oh, for Danish people. Yeah. Oh, that's really cool. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, you mentioned to me earlier today, actually, that someone on LinkedIn had reached out to you. Yeah. Can you tell me more about that? Mm -hmm. He reached out to me regarding sales, like sales and marketing position. Mm -hmm. yeah. Is it an internship or a full time position? I'm not sure. I think it's full time. Full time. He wanted to travel towards, like, from Dubai to Denmark and Thailand. Oh, okay. So it'd be a travel position. Okay. Um, well, besides the fact that it's maybe full time and it might be traveling, is it a company that you would be interested in? It's uh, like an energy company. Mm -hmm. I think that could be a good choice. We have in Denmark also a lot of energy companies, which could be like nice maybe getting a step inside. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Um. So what could you do with this this person who messaged you on LinkedIn if you were interested in interning at that company and maybe not a full time? What I could do? Yeah, what could you do? Oh, I could ask him. You could ask him? Yeah, if they have internship positions open. I already researched a company, like the name it up online, mm -hmm. and it looks like they have some graduate programs as well. Mm -hmm. So maybe they're open for internships. Yeah. Yeah. Is that something that you're interested in or not really? Mm, maybe. Maybe? Yeah. Okay. So what I'm hearing is that you want an internship and you're seriously going to start looking for an internship when you get back yeah. from Christmas break. Mm -hmm. And you want this internship to have something to do with business um, and the different options you have to help you get this internship is searching on the internet, mm -hmm. using the resources that Holt has here, going to networking events, reaching out to people, 
and going to some of the events put on by the Danes and Dubai group. Mm -hmm. You also recognize that you need to complete your CV and tailor your CV to your in to an internship. Yeah. So between now and when you want to seriously begin searching for your internship, what is a step that you can take or a couple steps that you can take to help prepare you for that? The CV. The CV. Yeah. Okay. This guy he would ask me to send the CV, so I, that could be nice having it done already. Okay. So I already attended some of the Hulk CV courses, mm -hmm. but I just haven't got around the time for finishing it up. Mm -hmm. yeah. When do you think you might have some time to finish it up? I think it should be possible to finish it up before we go on Christmas break. Okay, so even before you leave. Okay. Yeah, because I'd like to get some feedback from the advising group. Mm, okay, yeah. yeah. Um, so to help you complete your CV, what, what steps do you need to take to complete your CV? Um, right now, I think the format is right, the way I've written it up, but um, I haven't added all the actually uh, information about what I've been doing, mm -hmm. like my responsibilities and stuff. I find it hard to start it with that. Mm -hmm. Like the description? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Part. description yeah. part. Yeah. And also, I find it hard sometimes selling myself and selling how good I am. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So what can help you sell yourself? Um, I, I know I've been good at what I'm do, doing, mm -hmm. for sure, but I don't like to brag. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's kind of uncomfortable. Yeah, 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 exactly. And it's not really, like it's really out of my nature and culture to to do that. So, mm -hmm. I don't know, for me that's like the hardest step also in mm -hmm. both writing CV but also job interviews and stuff. Mm -hmm. And selling myself that like really good to what they're doing and stuff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So how, what can help you with that? I don't know. Mm -hmm. Who, is there someone that you know who seems to be really good at selling themselves? They're able to show that they've accomplished something, but you don't get the wrong vibes from them. I don't know. I think Anthony is good at networking mm -hmm. and talking to people. Maybe also selling himself. Mm -hmm. He's really confident in that, I think. So confidence. Mm -hmm. What else? What other specific traits do you see in Anthony that you think allows him to sell himself, but not brag? He somehow sometimes come off as like he doesn't care what other people think. Mm -hmm. like, yeah. Okay, so I'm hearing confidence. Maybe he's not too concerned with how others perceive him, and that mm -hmm. gives him more confidence. Yeah. Yeah. So, besides looking at someone else who can model yourself after, what are some other ways that can help you? determine how to brand yourself or represent yourself in a positive way on your CV? Like, I can use uh, the, the HALT uh, student, mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. what is it called, advising for a job. I think she would be able to help with getting the right words, do some more research online, I guess, but that's just with the writing part, because one thing is writing the CV, Another thing is if you actually go to the interview. Mm -hmm. Right. And being able to. Mm, yeah, right, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I totally agree. Yeah, great <laughs> agree. Okay, so I'm hearing that um, in order for you to finalize your CV by um, the time that you go to Christmas break, you need to first figure out how to sell yourself on your CV. And two options that we've come up with is that you could speak to Anthony or observe Anthony a little bit more and see how he finds that balance between selling himself and bragging. Mm -hmm. And then also using some of the whole resources, like the career advisor. Yeah. And I don't, actually, I don't know if you know this, but um, they have a worksheet that talks about how to write those statements. And it helps a lot. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, so I can forward that to you yeah. if you want. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so those are two steps I heard you say. Mm -hmm. 
So before you leave for break, of those two steps, are there more any more options that can help you write those statements or help you finish your CV? Mm -hmm. What's preventing you from, you said earlier you just haven't gotten around to it, so what will motivate you? Because it's only going to get busier between now and the end of the term. Yeah, true. Mm. Yeah. I feel like I should just do it. Like, for example, what motivates me right now is this guy asked me for the CV, so that's mm -hmm. a huge, huge motivation to like finish that and see. Mm -hmm. So knowing that someone else is waiting for you. Yeah. Okay. So external pressure. Yeah. Okay. And deadlines. And deadlines. Yeah. So would it help you to set a deadline for yourself? Yeah. I guess you already did, right? The end yeah. by Christmas break. Yeah. And you want to have the career advisor, you said, look at it before you leave? Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. Um, how are you going to make sure that you meet with the career advisor before you leave? Mm, I know she has this drop in meetings. Okay. So I guess if I'm done by the 10th of December, okay. I'll still have time after okay. those days. All right. So to recap from the beginning, mm -hmm. you said you wanted to get an internship in business. And you're going to start seriously looking after break. But before break, you want to finish your CV. Mm -hmm. And you want to meet with the career advisor before you finish, or once you finish your CV. You need this external pressure, this deadline, you have other people you can look at as a role model, and these online resources. So after you come back from Christmas break, how are you going to get your internship? What are you going to do? Mm -hmm. You already, so like we said, you already have internet, hold, networking events, reach out to people, and the days in Dubai. Are there any other ideas you have on how to get an internship? Once you have that perfect CV, I don't know. I think these are like the first. I would like reach out and meet them. Mm -hmm. yeah. Who are you going to be reaching out to? Companies. I might go to LinkedIn. How will you know which companies? Look online. <laughs> I don't know. Really okay. Research. Like, I think I need to do a lot more research about maybe also clarifying what I want to do. That will help yeah. a lot. Help you narrow down which companies you want. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So first you need to decide what kind of internship you're looking for. Yeah. Yeah. What will help you decide? It's a pretty big area. I think looking at some of the work, I don't know, work, the work tasks. That the work tasks. What is that? Uh, the internship. Like Oh, okay. The, yeah. Like the job description? Yeah. 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 Okay. Um, and see what what can fit with my future. Let me ask you, yeah. what does an ideal internship look like for you? Mm. I don't know, actually. Like, so, so, I would like to get an internship in I would still do the rotations mm -hmm. elsewhere. Mm -hmm. So where it's possible to take those weekends off and go to the rotation. Oh, so you wanna stay in Dubai and live here. Yeah. But fly all the way to Shanghai yeah. or London yeah. for the weekend? Yeah. Whoa. Because wow. we were told that the rotation like was yeah. short. Yeah. Yeah. It was only the weekend, so I guess that could be like an option. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's definitely an option. Mm -hmm. um, someone will, yeah, allow that. And full time. Like else. Okay, so you want to work 40 hours a week during the week. Yeah. Okay. But still be able to, to attend the weekends. So when, do you want to start this internship after Christmas break or when do you want to start the no, I'd like to start it from when our module. Module C. Yeah. Or is it DME? Module yeah. DME. Yeah. Okay, so you have some time before you go to start. Yeah. Okay. 40 hours a week, be able to take the weekends off. Okay, what else? 
Okay, so since we're roughly at time, I think we did a really good job talking about what your goal is of getting an internship, and mm -hmm. your specific goal is to start looking for an internship once you get back from mm -hmm. Christmas break. Yeah. And what's going to help you is finalizing your CV before you leave and getting it reviewed by the advisor. What you're going to do to help you with that CV is you know you already have a deadline, external deadline from the guy on LinkedIn. You have those role models and you have those resources online. Um, before we wrap up, is there anything else you want to add to this session? No, I think I'm good. You're good? You feel good? Yeah, I, think I know where to, where to go. You know where to go? Yeah. Okay. Good. Well, I'm glad we have this session. Me too.